I want to say thanks to DOD VIP who provided this Glock 43 that I'm about to do a video on, even though I think this gun inherently as it is, is trash. I'm a little late to this Glock 43X. Mm. This is gonna go under one of those classic. When I heard about the gun, I didn't care about it. Um, I have a 43. 43 shoots really well. I like it a lot. It was actually my go-to carry gun. Then the six-hour P365 came out. I made it obsolete. So then, when I heard that they were coming out with the 43X, I felt the same way I did about the 43X that I did about the 19X when they said that was coming out. We all know I don't, and I didn't give a about that. So if I didn't give a about the 19X, probably easy to come to the conclusion that I absolutely unequivocally do not give a about this gun. Look, it's a good gun. It's a shooter. I, sh I shoot the, I shoot it well. Like, there's no denying that. Like, to be honest with you, this shoots better than the 43 because it is set up in, a, in my ideal configuration, which is a longer slot, longer grip with a shorter slide. It minimizes, you know, muzzle rise on the actual gun. So I shoot this gun well. It feels amazing in hand. The trigger on this one is great, but that's not saying shit because everyone knows that Glock triggers are like that bag of mixed jelly beans where it's like if you if you're not paying attention to how you're eating them you're gonna pick up the that one flavor that's just freaking disgusting or sometimes you pick a flavor and it's really good that's that's the, that's Glock triggers some of them are exceptional out of the box some of them are just terrible um, but by and large I give no f about this gun I really don't and it's because of this. 10 rounds? What the f am I supposed to do with 10 rounds? And a gun that's bigger than a 43 that had what? Six, seven rounds? That was that was an insult too when the 43 came out. Six, seven rounds? What the f What? Like, this gun is useless to me. It's utterly useless. Completely useless. So I thought. Then something happened. One of my very good friends came out with something that to me has completely changed the game. Yeah. So folks, what you're looking at here, and I'm pretty sure a lot of you already know what this is. This is what I was just shooting. This is the, the Glock magazine that comes with the gun, 10 rounds, it's freaking ridiculous. This is what I'm about to shoot. This is a magazine from Shield Arms. It's S15. It's called S15 because where this little moronic piece of shit magazine carries 10 rounds, this beautiful, amazing specimen of a freaking magazine carries 15 rounds. 15 rounds. I'm gonna try this. Let me, let me try to put this in a context for you. 10 rounds. 15 rounds in this little tiny piece of nothing that shoots well, that feels great in the hand. This particular one has a great trigger. Terrible sights, but they all come in terrible sights. But 15 rounds in this little tiny, look at this, look! And it doesn't, it doesn't even extend. It's not even. Good God, y'all gonna think I'm a psycho. <laughs> it doesn't, look, look, look. Oh my God, the base one actually sticks out further than this one. Oh, no, it's about the same. <laughs> but, <laughs> but 15 rounds. Anybody who's been watching me for a long time knows that I am a capacity whore. The more bullets, the better. That's the saying. More bullets, more bullets, more bullets. 15 rounds? <laughs> Let me shut up and just start shooting. <laughs> this is so lovely. <laughs> yeah. 
He's excited <laughs> oh, well, he, he wants to play fair. Oh, the party never ends. Got another one. Uh, let's go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> it just keeps shooting and shooting. Let's go. There we go. Ah, let's go further. All right. Oh, check this out. So, 15 rounds? 20. <laughs> they come with a base plate that gives you five extra rounds. This is heaven, folks. We are living in the golden age of firearms. We have a gun that is about the size of my hand. And we all know that my hands are like hobbit hands, but whatever. And no, that, that, that saying that, that come, that's not true. Anyway, the other thing is though, um, <laughs> look at this, look at this. 20 rounds, 20, 20, 20. There's nothing intellectual about this video right now. I'm just geeking out over these magazines because by and large, this is... <laughs> uh, this, the, the, the 20 rounds, 20 rounds, 20 rounds. I'm just, I don't need, there's nothing to say. There's nothing to say. Nothing to say. We're just gonna shoot. Oh, you thought I was done? I got more. Another 20 more rounds. <laughs> Let's go. Ah! Yes. You would swear I was shooting. Look at this. It just keeps going. It just keeps going. Because this 15 round magazine fitted with this extension, 20 rounds. 20. Look at this, this is so pretty. Like, we're shooting so much, the gun's getting hot. Oh. All right, all right, I think I'm out. Damn it. Okay, so, <laughs> all jokes aside, I really, like I said, I didn't care about this gun. This gun meant nothing to me. It was just me, to me, Glock making a gun nobody asked for, which I thought that's what the 19 was. And the 19 is that, however, the 19X. However, the 19X shot so well, felt so great in my hands, I made concessions for it. I, I was like, okay, all right, I get it. I don't think that's what they were intending. I don't think they felt like, oh yeah, we're gonna make this gun and people are gonna love it because it shoots so great. Nah, it just happened to be that way. But because it does it so well, does it so well, it just, I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. And I love the 19X, I absolutely love the 19X. And you get, what, there's like 18 rounds, 17, 18 rounds in it, so makes sense. But this, 10 rounds, 10 rounds is, if this gun was only relegated to 10 rounds, it belongs in the garbage. I'm sorry, it just does. There's just too many guns out here. You have the P365 where you get 12, 13 rounds in a gun that's smaller than this. Like, no, it belongs in the garbage. But when you add these shield arm magazines, like this is 20 rounds and but this this 15 rounds that's 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 a fighting gun right there the standard for ages was the glock 19 and it had 15 rounds and it's almost damn near double the width of this thing and it's actually not like think about it and here's the beautiful thing these fit in the 48 so all of you who love the longer slide here you go 48 this fits on 48 as well 15 rounds with a magazine that actually works. That's the thing. 
because there are a lot of magazines, aftermarket magazines out there that usually they do something novel, but then kind of suck when it comes to reliability. You watch me just go through what? How many rounds was that? 40, I went to law school to get away from numbers, so I'm just guesstimating here. If I had 20, it's four to two rounds, from this, 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 about 60 rounds, something like that. Like, and nothing, not a hiccup, no issues whatsoever. Now, um, from what they say, this is not what I've experienced, but from what they say, um, you might want to, after some point, change the magazine release on the gun because of the metal magazine wearing out the magazine release. I'm gonna be honest with you, this was supposed to be a video about the 43X. It has turned into a video about these magazines. I'll put a link in the description for you to go and check out my write-up on these things. Um, I have never so willingly wanted to put my name behind something in my, and look, dismiss the fact that he's my friend. I didn't even know it, these magazines were him. I found out about the magazines before I realized they were actually him doing it. We just hadn't talked in a while, so it was like, oh, <laughs> But, like, these are awesome. These are freaking awesome. This single-handedly, this piece, this piece of metal, single-handedly, will probably likely have me go back. I have gone away from, I, I was carrying a 26 for a while, um, I was, and then from there I was carrying the 43, and then I've been carrying the P365. This is starting to hedge its way back into the rotation in ways that I never anticipated. I thought I was done carrying Glocks for the most part. Um, we still carry my 26 from time to time and my 19. But for the most part, I was carrying the P365. This, Jesus, man. With this, with this magazine, with, like I said, without the magazine, trash. Exceptional. Trash. Exceptional. Trash. Exceptional. You know what else to say? Like, I, I love this thing. I mean, yes, I do like the gun. That's the funny thing. As, as, as throwaway as I think this gun is, I like it. It shoots well, handles well, feels great in hand. I, I mean, it shoots better than my 43, and I love my 43. So, you take that, couple it with 15 rounds, and then my minimal style holster, I'll put a link to that video here, put that together, it's, you can't, you can fight with this gun. That's it, like, this was supposed to be about the 43. I turned it into a video about these magazines. And that's the truth. I'm not making that up. This was supposed to be a 43. And then I said, you know what? Forget it. There's nothing to say. Just trash. Exceptional. Trash. Exceptional. That's it. Right now, there's a culture war against the Second Amendment, which is why I need your help spreading our message to counter their message. You can help do this by leaving a comment, sharing this video, and clicking the bell and subscribe button. Let my voice be your voice and let them know you want to keep America tactical because the right to keep and bear arms shall not be infringed wasn't a suggestion, it was a directive. Also, if you're wondering where to purchase your AR-15s are essential, I will not comply. I am the militia. I lost all my guns in a boating accident and your state specific Keep America Tactical shirt. Click the link next to my head or the link in the description section. Or if you're watching this on a mobile device, tap the small triangle on the lower right hand side of this video and click the link in the description.